So I'm coming into Serenity's home. Well, actually it's Linda with Serene and Simple Life home. And this is Serenity. Yep, this is her home. And I'm gonna show you around. It's been such an awesome opportunity and beautiful thing to be here. Here's the apartment buildings where they house international students that come in to work at Ruby's and this is the entire this is the employee campground as you can see there's lots of big rigs and there's a few small ones this was the first season for car campers yay for Ruby's they took it to the board and perhaps I will be back here next year let me show you around guys what's going on Linda here, Serene and Simple Life. I'm going to show you around, give you a little rundown of what my morning routine is on my days off. And remember, this is after the fact. So, what I'm doing today is just, you know, I've been here for, I don't know, two weeks, but now I'm long gone. <laughs> uh, safety reasons, but here's the campsite as I was showing you in the intro. And this is my home. So when I wake up in the morning, there's my little dressing room. You know, I got my shorts on, do my thing. And if she has this covering on her, if you've watched any of my other videos, I did a little dancing in the wind video, but I've got little clips here. Put this little gray cloth that I was gonna use for craft shows that I never did, so it came in handy. We like to find two-fold, three-fold things, reasons for things. It's staked down really well. A uh, guy here helped me, the maintenance grounds man. This is a beautiful, beautiful area. This is uh, Ruby's Inn employee campground. I don't know, there's probably a couple hundred of us here. And way over yonder, I showed you the buildings. And then there's another building way, way over there. I'll maybe give you a tour later of, uh, or maybe even before this, of the, the grounds a little bit later. But... Here's where I will, you know, do some morning devotion or, and, or, you know, check out my messages on my phone, etc. And this, I love this table. This folds together and goes in a nice little black bag in the trunk of Serenity. But anyways, when I get up in the morning, I do my personal business and then I put my shades on my windows. I love these guys. Look at this. You know, these are... I don't know, really, really inexpensive, and I slide them over the windows so it gives a really nice airflow. And there's my clothes, so first thing in the morning I'll pull out my shorts, and there's my shower bag right there. There's the umbrella. It was raining yesterday, about a half an hour downpour, so again, this is after the fact, but I'm drying out this plastic that I cover my uh, canned good containers with that's under the picnic table, I'll show you. And I've got Jackery out because I'm going to do some business today. I am designing in the process, maybe already done, um, a Serene and Simple Life 30-Day Inspiration Collection. I'm so excited about. So that's my project for today. So I'm powering up Jackery. She's at 55% right now. And again, I've done videos on this, but maybe I'll do another power video at some point, or already have. I'm not sure. You know, I film it in advance because I'm working 40 hours a week trying to keep up and have a serene and simple life in the meantime. <laughs> and these are the guys that I, if you watched the mouse videos, I put these out around my car. Eh, haven't had to worry about mice. As you can see, this is all open. This is not like when I was in the forest. So... Uh, my neighbors next door have been here for three years. They said they've never had a problem with mice. And there was problems with mice in all the RVs where I was before. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I put them out for, they're, they're like a fun ambiance. And once I buy something, I like to use it. I don't want to just throw it in the trunk. So I do light those up at night and I'm powering them up now with the solar. And then right here, 
I uh, am going to do or I've already done a what I eat in a day but I stocked up on food at Walmart because Walmart's about I don't know a couple hours away and you know I'm a penny pincher I'm frugal so I don't want to drive to Walmart so I stocked up on my canned goods and inside here is my propane I don't know some oatmeal packs some soup packs uh, things that I don't want to get wet, just some miscellaneous inside there. I've got four bottles of propane. And here I bought this, well actually I had this, I was keeping my uh, product in, in the trunk, but now that I've sold so much product, I had a loose one to use, or, you know, one that was empty. So I've got everything contained, my paper towels and coffee, and inside my little container here I've put my, I put my paper plates and some silverware so it's easily accessible. And then I've shown you propane stove before, but you know, there's always new people. So sorry for the repetition for those of you who've already seen this. Uh, propane and butane little gas one grill. And I love this shield. I don't know how I ever did without it. I used the case before as a shield, but <laughs> it's not the same. And there's the Serene and Simple Life mug. Having my coffee this morning, and I'm going to make for the first time some Aunt Jemima pancakes. So down in that blue bag is my a box mix of pancake mix inside some plastic. And let's see what else. Told you about the solar. Love my table. Wolf Wise tent. This has gone through a beating back in Arizona, but I'll, I'll tell you, I use things <laughs> till they fall apart. I don't know why. I like new things, but I also don't like to replace things and I guess you could say that about Serenity although she's a different kind of keeping her for the long haul yeah I'm thinking by the time this is aired she's probably a little over 200,000 miles yay so let me take you around on the other side if it rains um, I throw the things that I don't throw them but there's the other uh, little window shade but here's my bedding that you've all seen before. Here's my craft bag I can easily access. Here's my shirts. They gave us three shirts. How cute is that? And so, and I can wear jean shorts. I can wear um, little skirts. Oh, it's just uh, jeans. It's just really fun. All we have to do is wear their shirt. Love it. This is the Reflectix. You know, felt on one side. and So I put these up at night. And then in the... You know, I open these doors, I put open and close them quite a few times during the day. I'm not using that, I'm heating up my water in the morning. My shift was seven to, well, quarter till seven till three. So I was up around 5.30 or six. Here's my ambiance light, my name tag. I hang it here so it's easily accessible. There we go. And here's, there's Linda, yay! Bryce Canyon. I don't know, I might come back here next year too soon to tell right now and then the backpacks right there because I'm gonna be getting to, to, to work I always put that behind the solar and the solar sits in the back here and one more spin around it's supposed to maybe rain today so I've made a methodical plan here that here's space to put that little black container that's sitting here I'll throw this and this little basket of miscellaneous inside the car. I'll cover these guys. There's some snacks in here. I'll show you those later. I'll cover this all with the plastic and I'll definitely take down the solar once the clouds start coming in a little more. It's nice and beautiful and clear right now, but Utah can get like little flash floods in an instant. Guys, everything I've shown you here is links in the description. I'm an Amazon affiliate. Thank you, Amazon. Anybody has that opportunity, so, and I make a few cents, and I am very, very grateful for that because those few cents add up into lots of dollars. So thank you guys, and hope you enjoyed the little tour. This is meant for like a big, big rig, but, you know, and this awesome tree that they gave me. I actually moved three times. Well, they didn't give me the tree. <laughs> Moved three times. I was across the way and it was way too open and the neighbors weren't too happy about that. The, while I was gone to work, this was blowing in the wind before it was staked down properly. And actually, Randy and a couple other guys from uh, Caravan One, thank you guys. 
uh, helped me with this the first time around in Arizona. So really appreciate that. And then I was up, there's also housing up there for people who are full time. And I was up against the road there too. And that was just too noisy near the playground. But anyways, that's enough of this babbling brook for today. I am enjoying my day off here. Hope you've enjoyed seeing a day in the life here. My little home. If it gets to raining, there's a little employee area near the laundry room that I'll walk to, or I'll go over to Ruby's Inn and find a place to plug in and, and do some work. So that's it, guys. Hope you enjoyed. I've loved this job so far. I've only been here a couple weeks, but when you watch this, hopefully I'll have said I've been here a couple months, and I'll give you the maybe an exit tour. How about that? Maybe that'll be next week because this will all be posted after I'm gone, if that makes sense to you. If you are a YouTuber, that makes sense. And that's just how we roll. We don't do videos where we're at. That's just not safe. So, anyway, guys, thank you. And please subscribe, click the bell if you haven't already. And remember, joy in the journey and blessings in your day. Bye.